Hey guys, me and Alex are back with another awesome box sent by a subscriber. Yeah, this one looks awesome. It's packed full. There's a lot of stuff in here I've never seen before. I was going to say to you, doesn't this box just look amazing? It looks awesome. And there's some stuff in here actually, now having a second look, that I recognise. But yeah. it looks like we're getting different flavours, which is and so good. And different variations. I'm super excited about this box. There's some lovely savoury bits in here as well, yeah. isn't there? Okay, let's start with the card. And so. also our mum sent us something again. <laughs> <laughs> little Debbie. Little Debbie sent us a little lunchbox Yeah, classic. if you don't get that joke, our mum's name is Debbie. Yeah. And she's little. <laughs> yeah. While we're here, I would just like to say hello to all of our new subscribers. I feel like we've had quite a oh, few. Oh, we've got new subscribers. We've got new subscribers. Oh, we have. Hey, to the two of you. No, <laughs> thank you. I feel like we've had um, quite a few new subscribers recently, and some people have noticed that in the comments. You know, Jane, who always comments. Oh, hey, yeah. Jane. She noticed that we had some new subscribers. Oh, we've got some lovely new comments in there. So yeah. thank you to everyone who has subscribed recently. We hope you enjoy our videos to come. Mm. We've got plenty more of these to come, haven't we? Yeah. There's okay, this there. is like the cutest card ever. This is lovely. Inside this card, we have a photo. And it's so nice when we see a photo because yeah. it's like we can relate to who you are yeah. and we know what you look like. So um, this is from Stacy, and here is her beautiful family. I'll message That's and see cute, if we can. It? So we've got Stacy, her husband and her two daughters. So dear Kate and Alex, I've included snacks that Chad Chad, that's obviously the husband. Hey, yeah, Chad. I was going to say, isn't that the daughter's name's down oh, there? Oh, Chad, Shailen. Wow, Shailen, Shailen and Eden. Eden. What Lovely amazing names. names. Do you not just think, though, Chad, so American. Yeah, that's such, such an American, American name. name. Dear Kate and Alex, I've included snacks that Chad and I grew up with, along with some of our current favourites. That's so nice to yeah. hear, isn't it? We love your channel, and you and Alex are a lot of fun to watch. Hope you enjoy some of these treats. Much love from our family to yours, all the way from West Virginia, US. West, West Virginia, Virginia, running, running over, over, take me home. I am. Um, Country roll. I was going to say recently, but it was actually quite a while ago. I went to Aruba. They played that song so really? much over there. Stacy, Chad, Shaylin, and Eden, thank you so much. Well, We're I've so been to Virginia, like but I wonder if it was West or. Right. I'm excited. So am I. And do you know what I'm super excited about? What? The fact that there's birthday cake Oreos. Yeah, I saw those popping I've out the back. I've always wanted to try birthday cake Oreos. Okay, we've got um, a few savoury things. Should yeah. we start with the combos? Let's start with the comboss. No, com they're the comboss. <laughs> it's the comboss. You never knew. They could, no, they could have been. Made with real cheese, so that's reassuring. Baked These are snacks. Pizzeria pretzel. Oh, they taste pizzery. Oh, they taste, smell, smell pizzery. They're darker than I thought they'd be. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. These look delicious. Wow. <laughs> They do taste like pizza crust, don't they? Mm. We're flavouring that. So good. We're flavouring that's incredible. I love how the outside is hard and it's got like a little centre of mm. soft, cheesy, whatever that is. Mm. And it's amazing how the soft centre is still soft. Mm. Oh my word. I'm literally eating a pizza. Mm. And it tastes like the oregano. And what's is amazing is Oregano. Like, yeah, oregano. It's pretzel, but it's like round. Mm. These are actually so good. 10 out of 10. 10. Did you get these in like Ralph's? Surely. Well, someone said, mm, so flavorful, I'm like, mm. blow me at the mouth. <laughs> the glands are like. Someone said these are like a service station or like a gas station type thing. Oh, but we've surely. only ever, when we got petrol, we'd just do it with the card, wouldn't we? So we never went in. Yeah, unless they're at a different aisle than what we're looking mm. at. Mm. They're the incredible. Beer snack aisle. Yeah. Absolutely incredible. 10 out of 10, what mm. are you giving them? 10 out of 10. Mm -hmm. Should we go savour again? Yeah. Now this is goldfish. Parmesan. We love goldfish. Parmesan. Parmesan. Pa yeah, I was going to say that. Parmesan. Mm. We say parmesan. Yeah. They say parmesan. Mm. Baked with 100% real cheese. No artificial flavours or preservatives. Oh, well. I'm going to try not mention drinking beer in this video. <laughs> Smell that. They look like they've got nothing on them. Oh my word. Baked snack crackers. What, they haven't even got the sunglasses on? <laughs> I thought these were out of date, but in America you do... Um, Sell by. No, you do date. The month is first, isn't Oh, it? yeah, I see, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. They're good. The flavour's a lot milder, though. I wouldn't necessarily say that tastes like Parmesan. No. I would just say these taste like the original ones, but a bit more. Yeah, a it's like... 
doesn't actually taste like Parmesan. It just tastes like a stronger cheese. I Some think of them the pizza ones faces are better. On. We have the pizza ones, don't we? Yeah. I think they're better. I would say, out of all the goldfish we tried, probably not the top one on my list. No. But still nice. And out of these two, because we've got two savouries yeah. next to each other, snacks, I'd say the combos are better. Yeah. They're the new uh, king. They're like sky high. Mm. Got nice um, flavour on the fingers though afterwards. Mm. Okay, so the last savoury savoury thing are Pringles. Hey. Now we actually get salt and vinegar Pringles here, but it'll be interesting to see is there any difference. Also, the interesting thing is we don't get that size. No, but I feel like they're starting to introduce this size. Oh really? Like a midway size? Or was that just in Because we've just got like a small one. That might be in Or Spain. the normal size one. Yeah, we only have like these ones. Play and eat. Well, once you pop, you can't stop, can you? Yeah. I love salt and vinegar, but you're not the biggest fan, are you? I'm not. I don't mind it. I would just always pick something else. Right, that is so strong, isn't it? Salt and vinegar flavour on those. I Not say, bad. the vinegar is more stronger mm. in these. Mm. I, I would always just prefer ready salted or lightly salted to really? salt and vinegar. I love salt and vinegar. They do taste slightly different. Mmm. Mmm. They're yeah, really good though. These are delicious. They're delicious. Nine, what are you going for? Um, why am I putting them I all the way I don't know, I was going to say you're saving them for later. Yeah. Not me. Um, they're... Uh, they're a nine, yeah. They're just not as, I just don't think they're as good as the combos or the, what a mini gonna, Nilla. Okay, these are wafers. Nilla wafers. Quite often, these are used in baking recipes. Oh, they smell I really want to know the- What um, is that smell? It's just like vanilla. Vanilla. Yeah, but that tastes like another American, smells like another. Mm. Why do I keep saying taste for smell? No. Is that like an, it kind of smells like an ice cream wafer. Mm. Oh, nice. Because they are crunchy, but at the same time, they're kind of soft as well. Because I've seen lots of recipes for banana pudding, and this mm. is used in there, and I think they almost expand a bit and go into a sponge. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? They're from the same brand as um, Oreo. Oreo, yeah. Two servings. That'd be really good, like, in a car. I was just about to say that. You know, in your cup holder. Mmm. That's so they're good. They're nice. Though. I really want to kind of put that in some custard and see what mm. happens if it does turn into a sponge. Yeah, I could get on board with that. Mm. I'm going to give those a nine, by the way. I'm going to give them a nine. Oh, good. Yeah, really nice. Okay, so there's actually little post-it notes on some of these things, which mm. is so nice. A lunchbox Little Debbie classic. This double decker is a newer version. <gasps> it's double. I thought it was two. No, it's it's double. double. Technically, we've tried the oatmeal cream pie. Oh, but yeah. We haven't tried the double decker. We haven't tried the double decker oatmeal cream pie. I really enjoyed it last time. I really liked it last time. And what... I find interesting is how something that's like a pre-packaged baked good yeah. can still be so oh, wow. I just fresh break some more? seeming. Yeah. Like it can't be that fresh, can it? But no. And with this, you get double the amount of like cookie frosting and, and cookie. Butter. Oh yeah, so there's three cookies in there. Mm. <laughs> that one's a bit more cinnamony. Oh, it was like that last time. Can you taste that? Mm. You prefer double or normal? The thing is, I think double. I would still always prefer a couple of real cookies mm -hmm. and some ice cream or something in the middle. But the fact that you can just buy one of those in a packet. Yeah, and like so you gone. said, it tastes like you've just got it from a bakery. Mm. I'm going to give that an eight. What about you? I'm going to go seven. Okay. I think I've really enjoyed that, but it tastes more cinnamon than mm. I last remember. Okay, can we go for a sweet? Yeah. I'm so excited about these two things. The Starburst. Yeah, so we've got two different Starburst things here. Starburst Ooh, gummies. gummies, and then Starburst jelly beans. I've oh, never cool. heard of this. And she's got here, super popular jelly beans around Easter. I bought several bags and stocked up. They're hard to find now. Oh, they're interesting So they're shape, like aren't square. They? Always got like a cheese Square duck, gummies with an S on. You've got a cherry. It's like an, it's an S and like the Google Maps pin. Mm. So it's like, here's Starburst. Oh my word. The, um, the mm. chew on those is really nice. Sometimes when gummies are too chewy, they're not that nice, are they? Mm. Your teeth almost just sink through them. Get a chew on that. Mm. Oh, that orange is delicious. Oh, the strawberry's great. Mm -hmm. The texture on them is really good, isn't it? 
And thank you for giving us one of your bags of jelly beans, especially as they're hard to find. That's nice that you've given us a bag. Oh, wow. So they're like the jelly beans that are almost like But they're like even shinier. Yeah, shiny. I'm going to go strawberry. And they've got a little starburst on them. It says starburst. That's grape and cherry, I think you've got. The shell's quite thick to go through, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, really thick. And it breaks into them. Um... I'd say they're slightly smaller than a jelly bean, wouldn't you? Mm. You know what these remind me of? Anyone, I think they were only in England, remember Juicers. I know you remember the name, Juicers? but I don't remember it. After school, I used to love getting them, and then they just stopped and discontinued them. And I've not tried anything like them since, and these are the closest to I it. I much prefer the gummies. I do really love the gummies. But actually, the more I eat these, I really like these. I think I prefer soft candy to hard candy. Mm, I think you do. You want to try an apple? Yeah. I would say, oh, they're so close to me. The gummies for me are probably an eight, and the jellies, jelly, what are they called? Jelly beans. Jelly beans are probably like a six. I think I'm going to have to go ten. Ten for both. For both. <laughs> I was going to say the one's about half lower, but then I think, oh, are the jelly be beans lower? No. Are the gummies lower? No. Ten it is. What did you want to try in here? I wanted to try the milk duds. Although, have we not done this? Have these? No, we haven't. I don't think we've had, I think I was thinking had sugar raisinets. babies. We've had raisinets and we've had sugar ah, babies, good. but I don't think we've had milk Because I was thinking we'd already had them, but they're sugar babies. These are a classic and sold in most movie theatres. Is you... that a thing? If you if your product is sold in a movie theatre, does it have to be in a box? I think most of them are in boxes. Yeah. That's what someone said. Most things in a movie theatre so are in boxes. Caramel. So milk duds made with chocolate and caramel. And um, if you watch 13 Reasons Why, you would know that these were sold in a, a movie theatre. I love these. We don't get boxes in our cinema. No. Oh, oh wow. wow, these are so much bigger than Big I thought. chunks, yeah. By the Hershey Company. But hopefully there's enough caramel. That. That. Well, because there was you something really that was made by the Hershey's. Cheers. Isn't the patch frogs made by Hershey's? <laughs> Chewier than I thought. Yeah, much chewy. I don't I'm like them as like much it. as I thought I was going to like them. But I, I do like the caramel that's mm. inside. I think it's a really nice caramel. And you can't really taste the chocolate, I don't think. No. So it's basically really like the them. caramel. They're almost like a Rolo. Mmm. Really like a Rolo, just but more chewy. Chewier. Mm. I think they're delicious. I just think if I was going to a movie theatre, I'd be on the Raisinettes. So yeah. I'm going to give those a seven. I'm going to give these an eight and a half. Really? I think they're really good. That caramel chew is really lovely. Although the only thing I think is, it's weird that these are sold in, sold in a movie theatre. They're noisy. They're noisy. Yeah, but, but once, then a plastic once bag Once it's is, open, it? though, I don't think that's as bad no. as... I suppose. Yeah. True. And also, I reckon they're open, whereas yeah. you're like... That's true. Do you reckon that's why it is, then? I don't know. I think they've been in paper things for a long time, mm. so I think it might just be tradition. Maybe. But yeah, they're delicious. Knows? They're really nice. Really great. Shall we stick on the caramel front? Yeah, why is that? We've got these. Oh, cool. He's included some individual oh, things. Dove. Now this is Dove, but... It's caramel. Milk, chocolate and caramel. I'm excited for Thank this. Thank you for including some uh, like little individual ones. I'm really excited. I think we agreed last time though that Dove is not like our galaxy, even though it's the same branding. Oh, wow. This is like in... Um... I wonder what yours says. Live your life every day with no regrets. It will be worth it. Has yours got something else? Mine says, don't stop until you're proud. Lauren N. Colorado. I wonder Who's if these... yours from? Daniel M. Pennsylvania. Are these what people have I wonder have if they've in? got them off Twitter or... This what? is so cool. I'm going to boomerang this. Is it good? Mm. What type of caramel is it? I'm proud. I'm going to stop now. Oh, it is creamy and liquidy and delicious. Really? Mm, I think that could be a 10. You can follow us on Instagram, by the way, if you want. Yeah. In the Kitchen with Kate. You can follow Kate at In the Kitchen with Kate or you can follow me at Al Murdo. Yeah, I'm almost at a thousand. Hashtag get Alex to 1.5. Why to 1.5? I don't know, I was thinking two was a bit too much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. I prefer this Dove to the plain chocolate bar. Really? Well, we I do. I don't plain... know what I'm saying, really. We only Cause... have plain. I don't like, what are they called here? Galaxy. Oh, I don't really like Galaxy. Mental. And although Dove is different, 
it's kind of similar. So I don't like that, but I think it goes really well with the caramel. That's almost like a fortune cookie. Yeah. Like a nice thing. Like That's a, a definite 10 cookie. out of 10. 10 out of 10. We're not going to do Heath, are we? No, we have had we Heath have before. We have had Heath. I thought it was delicious. It's kind I of like a dime. I thought it was delicious as well. But because we get a lot of stuff, we're actually, instead of just like eating this again since we've eaten all and this, we'll, it. we'll probably give this to someone. Yeah. Now, we actually have Mentos here. Yeah, I was thinking for this exactly segment, why don't we put some Mentos in some Coke <laughs> and set it off like a Mentos bomb? <laughs> have we had a payday? I think we've had a payday. These look, but should we go again? Because I can't yeah, remember. Yeah, because I don't remember. A peanut caramel bar. It's like, I remember the Heath bar, but I don't remember this. Yeah. So okay, I really don't remember having one of these. Maybe we have not I don't think we have. I think it's just one of those classic ones we've seen. Also, we don't have many wrappers that are white. No. Right, so this is literally covered in, in peanuts. half peanuts. There's caramel in there. Is there like an explanation of what it is? Yeah, it's a peanut caramel bar. It is quite solid, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> not that solid. Sorry. I thought it was like proper solid caramel. I didn't oh, think it would do hold that. Oh, on. It was a peanut butter so in this there. This almost looks like a bit of a boost. So you've got peanut butter, caramel edge, something, and then peanuts. Oh, it's salty. Is it? Salty. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh. Like having peanuts. <laughs> it's so salty. But I love that being that salty. Mm. It's funny that there's no chocolate on that. It's so funny. It's like having a handful of peanuts. It's like having a naked Snickers. Mm. I actually mm. really like that. Look at the other end before you bite it. I oh, know, I saw that before. Oh, that bit was really caramelly. Yeah, it was. Mmm. Mmm. I love looking at my lips and there'd be salt there. <laughs> salt <laughs> I don't know how it got there, but <laughs> I loved it. <laughs> mm. I'm going to give that an 8. I'm going to give that a 9, I think. Yeah. That's I'm great. surprised that's not like a 10 mm. for you, but I reckon if there was chocolate on there. If there was chocolate, it would be a 10. Because mm. there isn't, it's a 9. Should we go Mentos yeah. now? So shall I get the bottle of coke now or in a minute? Or... <laughs> we can if you want. Mentos are just oh, classic, yay. aren't Strawberry they? Strawberry flavour. These are just classic. I reckon these are the same. Oh, mm. softer than I remember. Good flavour, good flavour. Mm. I never pick up the mm. chewy mint. I forget how good Mentos are. They are actually really good. I'm not sure I've ever had them. They're much softer than anything, and sometimes when I pick, I don't pick oh, up sweets. Oh, the ones that send off the coat, like aren't the they mint, mint ones? ones. Ah. The, um, well, I think they might work with this. Maybe it's the mint. But um, I quite often don't pick up Mentos because I think, oh, they're going to be really chewy. Mm. But they're not. They're delicious. And, and I actually, actually really enjoyable. like the yellow ones. I think I'd give them an eight. I'd give them a nine. Mm. Nine and a half, Which maybe. Which I'm surprised about. Absolutely delicious. Okay. Is there a birthday coming up? Has anyone got a birthday coming up? So it's birthday cake flavoured cream Oreo. I can't believe I'm finally trying birthday cake so Oreos. Every time we've been in America, we've just not seen them or they just haven't had them. Yeah, or I think they've had like a limited edition one instead. Stacey and Chad have also been kind enough to give us a whole box of the yeah, tray, like shall I say. Full size. Full size tray when really you probably could have just sent us a smaller one. So but do thank they do you them very much. In this. Surely they do um not in, Ring. Maybe not. in a lot of like the special flavours, they only seem to do like full trays, don't Maybe they? Maybe not then. Here we go. Are we ready? Yeah. Oh, isn't that just amazing how that pulls away? Oh. Oh, and look at the little bits of yes. confetti like in between. And, and they're not like wow. they're not officially double stuff or anything, are no. they? But look how much filling there is in there. Oh. Should There's we get so a close up filling. on that? Also, it's really hot here, so it's like. Yeah. The filling is so creamy. Oh wow. Mm. It's been a while since I've had one with the um, the original biscuit. Mm -hmm. But it's actually really good. And the funfetti isn't too strong, but mm. it's just there and it's nice. Like you say, it does seem pretty thick, the filling, doesn't mm. it? Is it definitely not double stuffed? No, but I reckon because it's Always made cake. with real cocoa. Mm. I could get down with a party that starts with combos and ends with <laughs> Oreos. It's not necessarily so like a slice of birthday cake. Mm. It's more like the frosting. Yeah, it's like the frosting just has a flavor of birthday cake. Yeah. It's not too strong, it's not too powerful, it's just right. They're delicious, what are you so giving good. them? I'm giving them an 11. The 11 saved for special circumstances. <laughs> I'll give them 11 like as well. Oreo <laughs> birthday cake. Cookies. Well, I feel then that the combos need to be 11. Yeah. Yeah, that's unfair. So if we're sticking with the normal scheme, there are 10, 10. but in a way there are 11. Those two are 11. Mm. That's like the savoury and sweet partnership. Yeah. 
of the levels. Go on then. The, for the final resistance. The huh? pièce de la resistance. resistance. So this is... Ghirardelli. Ghirardelli. What did I say? That's what did you I said. Say, but someone said it was wrong. Ghirardelli. Ghirardelli. No one pointed it out that I was wrong. No, I don't think so. Oh, well, we read this as Gira. Oh, but there's an R there. Yeah. Gira Deli. Gira Deli. Gira Deli. This is milk chocolate caramel. We could be wrong, but we let's know. We could be wrong, yeah, let's know. Like, te write it out how it mm. should be. And Stacey has written, I prefer this chocolate over Hershey. No, I don't think that's hard. <laughs> No. <laughs> well, the one, we had one of these before and it was absolutely delicious. Yes. But you're going to be really excited because this is this the milk is chocolate caramel. Milk chocolate caramel! And last time we had the dark chocolate and salted caramel. I did still and like it. And it was so good. I did still like it. It was so rich. But it was just so rich and also I'm not a fan of chocolate. This is luscious filling, moments of timeless pleasure. Now, this it is was timeless good quality pleasure chocolate, last time, wasn't it? it? Yeah. I lost all track of time and sense of where I was. Of San Francisco since 1852. Yeah, I knew that because... And Matt, who some Matt's... of you know, um, went He's to actually the... been to the, the factory or the shop? Or the place where they make it. It was, didn't he go on a tour? Yeah, he went on a tour. Bought me a Easter bunny. Oh, very nice. It's all right for some. I just, this just looks like such good quality chocolate, mm. doesn't it? Can I grab that piece? Wow. Yes, please. That caramel in the middle. <laughs> I think that there is um, the best chocolate bar I've tried from America. Mm. Why are so many people in America eating Hershey's mm. when you could be eating this? It might be a price thing, I don't know. It might be an availability thing. Shall we share another square? Oh God. Twist my arm. Twist my arm. I don't think you can get, this is the best chocolate mm. we've had in America. Hands down. Oh my word, that's almost like a soft Rolo. Oh, it's 10 times more luxurious Ooh. than a Rolo though. Oh yeah, I wonder what that'd be like in the fridge. I wonder what that would be like if you got one of those, you smushed it in the middle of like a cake ball or something. Oh my word, do you know what? Why do people use Hershey's for s'mores? That with a oh, marshmallow and a graham cracker. Two graham oh. crackers, that'd be amazing. And you wouldn't even need to put that over the fire. You just put the um, marshmallows over the fire. Oh, and that would squash it. No squash it. This that is on its hands own. down the best chocolate bar bubble yeah. I've ever had in America. Yeah, from America. From it's America. A it's a 20. It's a 100. Although it's I say 100. that, Mars ca Simply Caramel is still, no, Milky Way Simply oh, Caramel yeah, is still one of my good. favorites. This is incredible. That's I'd so love good. to know how much that is. That's that so good. Absolutely delicious. Did you enjoy that? I enjoyed it so much. Did you enjoy it? I really enjoyed it. <laughs> I would say that's one of my favourite boxes ever. Yeah. Uh, the it was combination so good. of all of that was just delicious. And it was nice seeing the photo of Stacey oh, and her family. So nice. I can imagine them sitting there eating and these eating things. And eating this and enjoying it at the weekends yeah. and that. And I hope you enjoyed watching us try it, Stacey and your yeah, family. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed hope this enjoyed video. So, so we're going to be sending you a box and I can't wait for you to receive it. Yeah, and also we're going to send you like a special concoction box yeah. for your family. But it's going to include some things from our new snack box which is more based on like biscuits. Yep. It's gonna have some tea bags in there, some stuff like that. And it's a bit more, it's not savory as no, such, it's but not it's not savory. as chocolatey. It's not as like, there's less candy in there. Yeah. It's a bit more kind of like, like what, you'd have, what you'd have with a cup of tea or- A sweet snack. And yeah. also we should say biscuits to us, cookies to you. Yeah. So if you'd like to get yourself a snack box or a British candy box, click the link down below and you can go check out all of our products. Yeah, and if you're having a party, we also do a one-off box which has four of, is it 10 different things? 10 different things. So you get 40, 40 items and I'd say that's enough for a party, isn't Perfect it? Perfect for like a, a sleepover, just getting your friends mm. round, a summer barbecue. You then all grab a bag and you have a little share round. Mm. Uh, and I think it'd be awesome. So if you just got one of everything, you wouldn't really have yeah. enough to share. It's not you? enough to try. Anyway, I absolutely loved that and I hope you guys did too. Don't forget to let us know what you think to these snacks. Have you had them before or which ones would you love to try? We'll see you very soon. Bye guys. See ya.